Welcome to the Audience of One Live at the Stables EP Song Tutorials. My name is Greg uh, and the song that we will be learning how to play now is Audience of One, which is track five off the EP. Um, we start with our capo on the fourth fret. The song's in B. B is a bugger of a key to play uh, on the guitar because you kind of have to play bar chords and and no one who plays acoustic guitar really likes playing bar chords. Uh, so I, um, sorry if you like playing bar chords. Um, I've put my capo on uh, fret four and um, I'm gonna play in with, with uh, basically with in the, in the G key. So it's really in B, so the song's in B, but I'm gonna talk to you now as though the song's in G because they're, they're the kind of chords and the shapes that I'll be making with my fingers. Um, we kind of, um, on the recording, we kind of pluck, uh, finger pick, pluck this, um, uh, the, the chord progression quite a way through the song. Um, so I'm basically gonna kind of run you through uh, it, kind of verse, chorus, bridge, that kind of thing. So we're gonna start with the verse. Um, now the first chord in the verse is a G with a B bass. Uh, so the way you play a G with a B bass is rather than playing like a G, uh, instead of uh, your middle finger on the um, on the, the bottom E string, is you put your um, index finger on the second string, second fret. Now, I'm I'm talking as though I've got a capo on fret four. So that's basically, if you can see there in the camera, that's a that's a G with a B bass. So that's how the song starts. So we go, and then we go C, and then E minor. And then D, and then G with a B bass, and then C. So that's kind of the verse uh, chord progression. So the way that kind of plays out is we go um, um, G with a B bass is going to be hard for me to say super fast. So let's just call it the cool new chord. Um, no, that's too long too. Let's just call it the, the new guy. I'll call it the new guy. So we go the new guy, C. E minor, D, the new guy, C. Let's do that again. The new guy, C, E minor, D, the new guy, C. So I'll sing over the top. In majesty, behold the risen Son of God. Your eyes are fire. And arms of grace have won my heart Your robe it covers over all my sin and shame Your voice it stirs by rushing streams in me again So there at the end of the verse, instead of going to the C, we go to the G So it goes... G with a B bass, C, E minor, D, G with a B bass, and then G. So we do that going into the chorus, and the chorus goes G, C, D, G, C, D, and then E minor. E minor, G with a B bass, C, D, I've stuffed it, hang on. Got it, back on track. So we go um, uh, E minor, G with a B bass, C, E minor, D, and then um, there's one, C, D, and then we go back into the verse. So I'm going to run that through again because that was a little shaky. So we go um, G, C, D, G, C, Take two, 
E minor, G with B bass, C, E minor, D, and then C, and then D, and then back into the verse. So I'm gonna sing over the top so you know how it goes. I sing for an audience one. I live for an audience one. I'm here for the king and him alone. This one. Basically like that. Now coming out of the chorus into the bridge kind of goes like this. So this one and we go to the C. D E minor and then G with a B bass. We just repeat that. C D E minor and G with a B bass. we end that we just repeat there's one throne it's for my we and it's for my king so at the end there um I'm here for the king and him alone there's one throne and it's for my king there's one So that is how you play Audience of One, Capo on the fourth fret, um, playing it in the key of G, but it's really in the key of B. Um, so hope that helps you uh, worship too and learn how to play this song, and I pray that it's a blessing to you.